on Estes against Greg Vaughn in the bottom of the first inning. And Vaughn drills a shot to deep left, his 17th home run of the year. Pods up four zip after one inning. Bottom of the second now. Runners at the corners for Tony Gwynn. That's going to drive in Craig Shipley. RBI number 115 on the year for Gwynn. Pods up five zip. Baker now at the ballpark comes out to take Estes out. Estes has not lost since July 18th, didn't have it in this one. Top of the fifth, pods up 8-1. Pete Smith against Jose Vizcaino. Smith knocks it down, recovers in time at first, and the pods roll by the score of 12-2. Five RBIs for Vaughn. Top of the third, scoreless, two on one out. Larry Walker against Ishmael Valdez. Deep to left center, Darren Lewis going back. Look out for the wall. Drops it. One run, one run comes in. Bottom four, one nothing rocks. Andres Galarraga says he has it. Nephi Perez says he has it. And you know what? No one has it. Carroll scores. We're tied at one. Zeal advances on a throwing error. And then the next man up, Lewis, singles to right field. Zeal coming home. Larry Walker's throw is there. And Zeal is the outer safe. The call is out. It was a good call because Jeff Reed gets Zeal on the chin. And he's out. Game still tied. Top eight, we're still tied. Man on first, two outs. And Reed, who had two home runs on Friday, hits a double off the wall in left center. Vinny Castilla being waved home. We have another developing situation. Piazza, the catcher, cannot hold it. 2-1 Rockies. Bottom nine, 2-1 Rocks. Bases loaded, one out. Eddie Murray with a chance. One, two, three. Bases loaded. Murray cannot come through. Into the five, four, Three double play, and the Rockies hold on a win by the final count of 2 1. So the Dodgers remain one game in search of 54. In Oakland, top of the first, Mike Oquist, the pitcher, doesn't give in, throws the breaking ball with three balls. One of two walks for Griff. Top of three, hits one to center. Ben Grieve, the rookie, routine, can of corn. Griffey's out. The right fielder makes the play. Bottom of four, Oakland down 3 2. Sugar, Mr. Poon. Jason Giambi, solo shut off Omar Oliveras, his second of the game, 19th of the year. We're tied at three in Oakland. Now, top of five, still tied at three. Kenneth singles to right center, his only hit. He was one for five. Top of the ninth now. Strike three, TJ Matthews, the heat. Now, bottom of the 11th, we're still tied at three. A chance for Oakland. Matt Stairs, fly ball to center. Junior misplays it, but then he makes the play and doubles off Jason McDonald at second. Bottom of the 15th, Izzy Molina in the house. Izzy Molina out of the house. The home run off Felipe Lira to end the game. A's win 4-3 and 15. 18 pitchers used in the game. It was only the third time that has happened in the majors. Seven of the 18 pitchers broke his arm while throwing in the bullpen. A broken humerus bone, he's out for the year. Top of the second, one out. Sandy Alomar flies to center. Roderick Myers, great grab. Top five, one out, one on for Bip Roberts. Two-run home run to left, his fourth of the year. It's his first homer hitting right-handed this year. Two-nothing Indians. Bottom eight, 2-2. Two -two. Johnny Damon, a two-run triple down a first baseline. Two runs come in to score. The Royals went up 4-2. They would go up 5-2 on a wild pitch. And the Royals go on to beat Cleveland. The final count was 5-2. But the biggest news, top of the seventh, Texas up 4-2. Jim Edmonds at the plate. Mark Sagman, who? Mark Sagman can't catch it. Garrett Anderson, next man up. Mark Sagman, who? We might not hear any more of him after that. Gary DeSarcina scores. Tim Salmon facing Mike Whiteside. Wild pitch, Tony Phillips scores. Tied at four. Next man up, Dave Hollins. The bases are loaded. Whiteside throws ball four low. Edmonds walks home from third with the go-ahead run. And Anaheim wins it by the final score of seven to six. The Angels. Bottom of one, Pedro Martinez, Steve Lockhart. One of 12 strikeouts for Pedro. The toughest thing in sports is to hit a baseball. The easiest thing is to miss it. Chipper, McGriff, and Ryan, who struck out twice in the game. Next batter, Michael Tucker. The Braves stack the lineup with left-handers. However, it's the right-hander who gets it done. Javi Lopez, uke to right field. A solo shot is 23rd. one nothing Braves in the second. Same score. Top of the fourth, Tom Glavin pitching with two on. David Segui. Lines out to two. Keith Lockhart. He doubles off Mike Lansing to end the inning. One of two brave double plays. Two on for Sigi again. Top of the sixth. Glavin gets Sigi to pop the short. Rafael Belliard makes the catch. Glavin escapes the jam. Sigi went 0 for 4. 3-1. Braves win. Glavin two-hit complete game. Grusland.
Last place Cubs, Ryan Sandberg. Day of the Cubs give Rhino a brand new Corvette. Long and lean, every young man's dream. Anxious moments for Jim Riggleman. Cubs holding on to a 2-1 lead in the ninth, but Terry Adams facing Mike Robertson with no one out. Bases loaded, ball gets away from Mike Hubbard. Scott Rowland scores. Bases loaded, still nobody out for Tony Barron. Chops it to Sandberg, who foul! Had his mind on his vet. The error allows Rico Bronia to score, and then look at this. Rhino strikes out. Phil's come down. From 2 nothing down to win three. Third by David Johnson. Bottom of the second. O's up 2 nothing. Chris Hoyles Brian deep to center. Hunter. Brian Hunter can't get it. 12th homer of the year. O's up three zip. Next man up, Mike Bordick. His second homer in his last three games. O's up four zip. Still bottom of the second. Two on for Eric Davis. 93. And Davis. Face hit to right. Brady Anderson and Roberto Alomar score. O's up six to nothing. Davis's first hit since coming back from colon cancer treatment got a standing O. The Bottom of the fifth, two on. Davis up again, comes through again. A single this time to left. Anderson scores. O's up by the score of 12 to 5. Davis leaving the game for a pinch runner and another standing O. As the O's go on to win, Toy Cone back from the shoulder problem. Joe Girardi back from the finger problem. In trouble early, though. Cone tries to pick off Sean Green. Martinez can't handle the throw. Santiago scores 2-0 Toronto. Cone, though, would calm down on the fourth. He's focused. Carlos Delgado will ring him up, sit him down. Benito Santiago ring him up, sit him down. Sean Green, echo, echo, ring him up, sit him down. Cone striking out the side. Bottom of the 11th now, tied at three. Bases loaded. Marty Jansen pitching. First pitch to Derek Jeter. A ball. Next pitch. That's a ball. Could have been a strike. Next pitch. Just misses. 3-0 three no, three no the count. Jeter watches ball four sale inside. Andy Fox comes home to score the winning run. And the Yanks clinch a spot in the playoff. The Carmine hosed Boston Warriors. John Valentin takes a fastball from Jamie Navarro in the hand. Stay in the game for a moment, but he would eventually leave. Speaking of pain, milk. The big hurt. Deep to, Deep to right center, but Darren Bragg got a groovy kind of glove. Great catch. Robs. The home run from the Big Hurt. Let's see it again. He was born in Waterbury, Connecticut. Bottom of the seventh. Red Sox down three run. Nomar Garcia Perra. Up the middle, a base hit. That brings in Jeff Fry and Darren Bragg. Garcia Perra's 200th hit of the season. Game tied at three. Top of eight. White Sox down 4 3, but Ozzie Guillen is clutch and clutches everything. Cameron and Abbott score. White Sox go on to win. Nomar Garcia Perra continues to have the greatest rookie season in the Jumbotron TV. There's McGuire. His first at bat, line sharply to third. Joe ran to the nice play. 5 3 put out. McGuire's second at bat, Esteban Loaiza hits him with the pitch. Next AB, cars trailing 4 1, runners on the corners, and McGuire goes down swinging. His final at bat goes down looking. 0 for 3, 2 Ks. His teammate, no luck either. Scarborough Green drills one to left, but Parsley Sage, Rosemary in time. Al Martin, great diving catch. Bottom of the eighth, cards trail 8 1, yes. Pitching now. Gary Gaetti, Gary Gaetti. Jose Batista, the batter. Tony Womack got hit with a pitch, and then that's Turner Ward actually chopping to David Bell, who kicks the ball. Jason Kendall scores, bucks up now, nine to one. Next batter, Al Martin. Gaetti pitching, Dow hits him on the knee. Pirates take a 10-1 lead. Cardinals saving their bullpen for next year. Next batter, Kevin Young. Grounds the third to Bell. He'll flip to second, and Gaetti's major league pitching debut is over. McGuire didn't hit the ball out of the infield. Still trails Maris by seven. The Boston Astros began their day three and a half up on the impossible dream box. Houston losers are their last two. One more loss. They'll be back to 500. Astros and Reds. Pokey Reese, sharp at short. Top of the second. Ricky Gutierrez up the middle. Reese steps on second, throws the first beautiful play. Game scoreless through three. Top of four, Jeff Bagwell with Derek Bell on first. Milk, two-run blast off Brett Tomko is 42nd of the year. RBIs 128-129, two-nothing Astros. More from Pokey Reese. Bagwell up the middle. Pokey, look at this. Another double play. Reds had three in the game. Derek Bell answers with his own defense for Houston, robbing Pat Watkins of extra bases. Astros win 4-1. to one. The win puts the Astros up four games at the time with eight left. Three against the Bucks.